and still talking innovative ideas. The International Climate Change Development Initiative, the Lagos-based advocacy group, and an NGO have built a sustainable and eco-friendly sanitation solution for students and teachers of a community school in Lagos, Nigeria. Their effort is geared towards curbing open defecation and ending plastic pollution across Nigeria, one pet bottle at a time. For these students, joy is an ending as finally some respite has come at a very good time. We are excited because since these days we didn't, we didn't have toilets, but we thank the DHL for giving us toilets. The absence of toilets has led to students defecating publicly, resulting in poor cleanliness and low school attendance. The children, the parents, the community themselves, all of us are very excited. The whole of this vicinity is only one school. They don't come because of that toilet issue. But since this toilet came, they have been coming every day. There is new intake. In collaboration with International Climate Change Development Initiative and DHL Global Forwarding, an eco-friendly and sustainable pet bottle toilet for students has been made available. I was actually excited. In fact, I was going through it from pace to pace from the beginning. When they started the foundation, it was actually very good. You could look at the pictures. When they started the foundation, they were laying that, the bottles. They used the bottles just the same way they laid the blocks. It was with a lot of excitement. I was so excited about it and I, I kept asking them, where are we? What is going to happen? The community, we are so, so, so supportive. The construction of the toilet took five weeks. The organizers initially started with 13,000 pet bottles, but eventually finished with 15,000 pet bottles. We are trying to cop up in the education. Secondly, we are trying to see how we can bring sanity, which we call water sanitation and hygiene to the community and to the school. How we are doing that is also to open job opportunity for women in the community that will be taking care of these toilets in collaboration with the CDAs and collaboration with the head teacher in the school. This is one of the many ways to curb plastic waste and reduce greenhouse gas emissions that causes global warming in the country and also a way to give back to society. <laughs>